while constructing a building we need to consider many factors like quality of the material quality of construction good workmanship in order to achieve the good quality of the structure it is very important to monitor the quality of the structure during construction stage it is not only very important to monitor the quality of the structure during construction stage it is also very important to monitor the quality of the structure once the construction is completed the structure needs to serve its purpose during its intended lifetime without any damage or without any problem so it is our responsibility to maintain the quality of the structure during its lifetime from the beginning we are talking about only one word that is quality we know during construction stage we can easily assess the quality of the material quality of the construction and quality of workmanship but once the construction is completed how we can assess the quality of the structure how we can maintain the quality of the structure hey friends welcome back to civil engineering mastery in this video we are going to discuss how we can assess the quality of the structure with the help of non destructive test as the name suggests we can assess the quality of the structure without any damage to the structure so without further delay let's begin now non destructive test is a valuable technique which is used to evaluate the properties of materials defects in the structure discontinuities in the material as well as helps to assess the overall conditions of the structure it is a method of testing the existing concrete structure to assess the concrete strength and durability nowadays it becomes the part of the quality control process it is also helps to investigate micro cracks present in the concrete crack depth and also it helps to find out the deterioration of concrete non destructive testing of concrete is a simple method of testing but it require skilled and experienced persons having special knowledge to interpret and analyze the test results let's look into various method of non destructive test the first one is ultrasonic pulse velocity by using this test we can detect the voids honeycombs cracks and other homogeneous conditions of the concrete next one is surface hardness method concrete strength is decided by its compressive strength which affects the load bearing capacity and durability of the concrete structure the surface hardness method is used to find out the concrete strength schemate rebound hammer is the instrument which is used to measure the surface hardness of the concrete it is the most widely used portable ndt instrument next one is pull out test this is a simple test which is used to measure the bond strength between concrete and other materials such as steel rod anchors and adhesives the test is conducted by inserting a disc or ring into the concrete and then we need to apply the tensile force to the disc or ring the force needs to be applied gradually to pull out the disc or ring out of the concrete the force required to pull the disc or ring out of the concrete is the measure of the bond strength so it is a valuable tool for assessing the bond strength of the concrete next test is impact echo test this test is mainly used to determine the concrete thickness also it is used to find out the defect such as voids honeycombing delamination and debonding in plain and reinforced concrete structures as well as post tensioned concrete structures next one is cover meter this test is used to determine the rebar location concrete cover thickness rebar spacing and also it helps to assess the bar diameter and bar orientation next one is half cell corrosion potential test as the name suggests this test is used to determine the 
corrosion of the reinforced bars as we know corrosion is one of the major defect in concrete structures it needs to be assessed properly in order to avoid the severe damage of the structure due to corrosion there are various methods of ndt test are available to find out the corrosion of reinforced bars half cell corrosion potential test is one of the method to determine the corrosion of reinforced bars this method measures the electrical potential between rebar and the surrounding concrete a higher potential indicates more active corrosion since there are many other methods are available to find out the corrosion of reinforced bars according to the specific circumstances we need to use the appropriate method of ndt test to find out the corrosion of reinforced bars also it is important to note here no single ndt method can provide a definitive diagnosis of corrosion however by using combination of ndt methods it is possible to get a good understanding of the extent of the corrosion damage and the need for repairs structural health monitoring is also important as like structural design we have to maintain a safe and reliable structural health condition different non destructive tools are required for assessing the integrity of the structure and the nature of the damage to achieve this the structural health monitoring engineers need to know different tools and their purposes so by using appropriate method of ndt we can find out the defect in concrete structures so friends i hope you all like this video please do comment in the comment box if you really like the content hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe the channel for more videos thank you for watching